was a nice car. Get out the fucking way. of options for the mature gentleman. Apologies for the smell, those tacos were a mistake. That's a gun that ticks all the boxes in my book. Everything in here has been personally tested by yours truly. Employee of the Month three times right here.
was wondering if you'd be back in again. Listening to you and those two friends of yours bantering back and forth, it was so cool. It was like I was in a movie or a music video or something. Man, what are you talking about? I love the hip hop. P.G. Jackson, MC Clip. That ain't real hip hop. No, no, of course not. I mean, what would I know? I barely exist outside this store. You probably think I'm such a loser. Excellent purchase. I'm getting to where the whole damn TV is. Who the fuck is this? The guy keeping you out of the gas chamber. Townley's on his way. We need to talk face to face. Warehouse off Dutch London and Banning. Oh, we can do more than talk, my friend. Gotta quit that shit, man. Yeah, I know. It's Caesar's place, round the corner from your house. Yeah, the more I see of your boss, the more I like it. I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. others associated with. So is he gonna be a problem? For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh well, boo-hoo-hoo-hoo for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Townley. Well, you don't see, driving. Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearthed his connections, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. Anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot. Look out! Before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush. One of them spent 10 years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or, or, we stumbled on the cash depot job. Brad went down, you went down. Trevor got away. The FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there, Trevor made you right away. The second he saw you. Hey! You remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Townley. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Back then, sure. 
Back then, sure. Not now. to talk. That hurts too much. <laughs> Mr. Phillips, ask him about Tahir Shavon. What didn't you ask me? I know it's out here. I did his home theater. <laughs> he lives in Chumash. The right on the Western Highway. But that wasn't so tough, was it? Chumash, you're driving. Remember. Terror does not take coffee breaks. <sighs> what a dick. 